First time I was on a motorcycle, I think I was in, uh, I want to say the sixth grade, sixth or seventh grade, and uh, a friend of mine had a little bike. His dad just let him ride it around. We got on that bike, and he's like, come on, let's go to this place where everyone's going to be, and he just tore to the park. He's a good girl. He's a good girl. And the first motorcycle I owned was a Harley Davidson, and I didn't have the money to pay anybody to fix it. I had to work on it, it broke. It was an old sports turn. I mean, it began right there, I had to learn. It was like on, job, on the job training. I was a musician first. So everything I do, I kind of, I feel like I approach as with the musician mind, you know, I want to make punk rock sound punker. I want to make, you know, heavy metal sound heavier. I want to make something pretty sound prettier, you know? I always want to push it. So that part of my life kind of, is in motorcycles too. So I, I think that my music life affects my bike building more. Um, I enjoy seeing people ride my work hard. <laughs> you know, I enjoy like riding with, with guys that are on motorcycles that I build or, and just really just seeing how they react to just enjoying them and being able to really ride them at high speeds and deep corners. I like it when people look at it, you know, oh, it's nice, it's pretty. To look at it, it's, that's, that's not what it's about. It looks cool, but that's not why it's cool. Mm -hmm. Dragster's cool because it moves through the air quickly. And everything about it is to help it get to the finish line faster. I like it when somebody can notice that.